Hey folks, here we are over here in Hanover, Maryland. We're looking at a khaki vinyl semi-privacy fence. It's about 200, 225 feet of fence. We used a 7 8 by 3 picket, 2 by 3 top rail. We offset the middle rail just a little bit as per the customer's request and we added some aluminum uh, H-channel to the bottom rail. Turned out really nice. Customers very pleased with it. They're using this to contain their cats. Um, but anyway, we'll walk in here in a few minutes. We'll take some video from the inside. Hold on a sec. We'll be right back. Well, here we go. We're viewing the fence from the inside. I'll kind of walk you around the property here real quick and show you what we've done. But it wraps the entire perimeter of the yard. Uh, I like the khaki color vinyl fence because it kind of blends in with the background. Um, it's not as uh, noticeable as a white vinyl fence. But both white and or khaki or tan vinyl fencing make a nice backdrop for plantscaping as you can see here. Turned out really nice and uh, it goes all the way around the property. It goes all the way over to the left if you can see it. It might be a little bit hard to see. We'll zoom in here a little bit. There's an additional gate in the back so that the customers can get out of the uh, <clears throat> fence with yard debris or whatever. And uh, hang on a sec, we'll go take a look at the right side of the house and we'll be done. Okay, here we are, we're on the right side of the house. <clears throat> Carried the same style fence all the way through, as you can see. We're coming up here on a, another single walk gate. All the hinges that we use on our gates are stainless steel, painted black. Um, you have a couple of different locking mechanism options. Uh, you got a ring lock. Of course, you have this one here, which can be padlocked from the inside, which a lot of people like that. We've added a gate brace to it to give the gate some structural support. Hope you enjoyed. Come back and check us out on the next video.